Hello and welcome to part one of my Civilization 5 series where I'll be playing as the Celtic Empire. I did do a previous video where I did the setup for this one, where I went through all the settings and I gave three maps and asked for advice which one to go with. I can reveal I went for the elephant start and I'd like to give a big thanks to all the feedback I got on Reddit, on Civ Fanatics and from the comments here on YouTube. And a special shout out to some people to give more in-depth advice. Lawrence Lott, Asterix Rage, Cool Cool Week, Raise the Anno, Super Noob Camper, Incomprehensible Garb. I, I love just reading these names out, I have to say. Although I'm sure I missed a few, there was quite a good response, especially on Reddit. It was close between Salt and Elephants, with probably the slight majority coming down on the Salt start. But I went with Elephants, and the reason why can be summed up with a comment I got on Reddit from James Nine Lives. And that's simply, elephants are cool. And I couldn't agree more. Elephants are cool, so that's why I went with this. With that, let's jump right into the game. I've one more person to thank, though. Um, let me find their name now. Zitos. They suggested, a very good idea, that I rename the capital as Dublin, as I am from Dublin myself. Uh, I think this is just about justifiable, given that uh, Dublin is probably the most populous uh, Celtic city in the world. Um... Although I think my third city is called Dublin anyway, so that might cause a bit of troubles. All right, I had intended to not go warmongering, but I got some advice that, you know what, you should just build warriors, turn them into pickish warriors, and you can rush anybody. You can uh, kill barbarians, you can do lots of cool things. So I am going to go mining. Um, I am a bit worried about how much food my city has, though. So I think uh, I will go... Food, then food. I need to just attack my nearest neighbor early and get a worker out of them. So that's sort of what I'm thinking. Let's uh, let's start with that idea. We'll build uh, warriors and um, we'll work on mining in 11 turns. We should be able to buy ourselves or upgrade one of these warriors into a pick uh, warrior. So I just want to find my nearest neighbor at this point um because th that's sort of my plan um yeah i don't know let me know what you think about that that's uh it's, i didn't take much convincing to go uh warmongering i have to say oh is this uh that looks like india or um who else uh, brazil no it's not quite green enough for brazil did india i think get something belief early yes uh i think india is the only one that gets a, a pantheon starting so that's probably the um good i don't think they're the biggest fighters in the world so that's probably a uh, a good enough uh, thing to attack i'm also once i get my pick warriors i should be able to clear out a lot of um, barbarian camps and uh, get lots of bonuses from it uh, especially when i get that and authority although maybe i'm not going to get authority too fast without a monument hmm okay uh let's Right, that's the nearest way to them. Let's clear out everything that's up here so we know what we're dealing with. By the time we actually attack them, it's probably going to be their second city we'll be attacking. Uh, although, yeah, if, they're, if their capital's open, I'll go ahead and take that. Um, what else? I think it was suggested that I get uh, pyramids. I just, I just don't see how I could get it with enough uh, doesn't the ai like you. go after pyramids themselves like i don't i don't really see i guess i could just go all production but then i i end up with <laughs> with no citizens i just uh just doesn't feel right or in any way good to me um but i'm not the, i'm not the best that i've heard it called max minning i'm not the best at being efficient in the early game so whatever what do i know basically <laughs> All right, we'll stay exploring it. Maybe... Oh, have I found any city-states? No. Um, yeah, maybe there's another neighbor close, but I guess... Oh, where did where did we meet England? I think it was down here or something. So they're probably off this part of the world. Uh, I'm playing on a tiny map, so there's only... There will only be uh, four civs total. So we've met half them already. Oh, that's nice. Uh, El Dorado. Um, nice natural wonder right beside us. That could be a second city. Maybe a third city. Something like that. That could be a nice barbarian camp to go um, cut my tea on before India. Or, you know, I think just go straight for India. 
like uh, with the when I get pick warriors. I actually, yeah, let's uh, get this Pathfinder to swing by India here and see if he has any hills up and around him. Um, we'll get this guy back into the capital to upgrade. I wonder what I need to upgrade. 20, 30, 40, 50. Um, I guess I was playing on quick map last time. That was a little faster. Yeah, okay, good. We met Milan. That's nice. Yeah. A, is that another Bavarian? You know, I might be able to kill them for, for Milan. Okay, with our second population now. So here's the decision. Do I... I feel that's the right decision. I like to get three instead of two. But that's 27 turns until I grow. This is just such a slow grow start. Uh, I think I need to go food. I need to build up my base as quick as possible. Um, nothing else is going to help though. Maybe a worker is the best to do. You know, even if I steal a worker off India now, is it? Um, I'm not going to... You know, I'm going to just build a worker. I just... Uh, I just need it. I need the food from wheat too badly. Um, I'll... No, I'll keep him here just so I can upgrade him to a pick warrior all the sooner. Okay, that's still the capital. Uh, what, what pantheon did they go? I don't think it really matters too much to me, but let's have a look. Uh, one fate for every three citizens in a city, and they get a lot of citizens fairly fast. So that's going to be pretty big. Uh, they might be able to see in and around their city a bit. Ah, Polynesia. Aloha, yeah, I'm going to have to remind myself what and how they do. I think it's something like... Is it built? No, it's Indonesia. I think building on all different continents, perhaps. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, let's see. Oh, I need to click into this guy. Okay, plus one site when embarked. I can always embark and move over oceans. This is not good for a small Pangea. Plus two food from fishing boats and atolls. Uh, no one has it. Yeah, I, I'm not too worried about that guy. Uh, unique unit, Maori's. Oh, what's this doing though? Be built on the coast. There's guess there's going to be lots of coasts on a Pangaea map. Uh, right. Let's see. Uh, there's a hill right beside them. Let's go into this view. Um, yeah, there's one hill right beside them. That'd be a nice tile to get a a uh, pick warrior up on. We'll see how we do. Okay, what do I need? I have my warrior. Okay, what do I have around me? Let's go back out of this. I need uh, camps for ivory. I am building a worker now, so that could be um, optional. Ah, enables production of food. That could, Yeah, I'm not going to use that, but fish. I would love to find fish. A granary will help. I need this. Um, you know, I'm going to build this on the hope of getting some fish, but also I do need the granary anyway. So uh, we'll go with uh, pottery, and then I will want to get camping, or well, trapping uh, for the camp, I should say. So let's line both of them up. Oh, I forgot to upgrade this warrior. I am curious how much it costs. Maybe I should get this second warrior back to another camp. Um, let's go ahead and... Oh, I forgot to look how much it was. That's about 35, was it? 40? Um, 35 I think it cost um, yeah what am I going to do with two guys uh, two pick warriors by the time he gets back probably I know I think maybe I clear a camp out first oh I could kill this guy let's see um, we can get him around you know, screw it. Let's declare war in India. And just, no, I don't know. Does that make sense? Um, I, you know, it does make sense to weaken them. One Pathfinder this early in the game is a lot of his, uh, his ability. So screw it. Let's do this. Uh, we might still go after the the camp, though. I'm not uh, convinced that that's not how to play this. Uh, we weaken them. We should get the kill with that. Okay, there we go. We're starting getting some fate in already. And I need this fate for... For my Pantheon. Actually, you know what? I probably need to kill a couple of camps for my Pantheon. Uh, let's, yeah, let's continue to get this warrior back to the capital to upgrade. 
and uh, these guys should be able to kill a camp on their own um yeah we'll kill this camp and then perhaps move into india and start like sniping in around the edges oh wait uh, does it tell me how much here to upgrade them no <laughs> uh well if it's 35 i've got it if it's i don't think it was much more than 35 40 maybe uh 45 uh but either way i'll have it next turn oh i forgot to get him next to the city Okay, it doesn't look like India has troops streaming out of me. That's uh, that's good. Anyway, I'm attacking over a river. What the hell am I doing? Yeah. Let's... Oh, do I have a hill here, actually? I have one right beside me, but still over a river. Uh, yeah, let's get into that. We'll kill this guy. Uh, let's... Oh, let's not leave him there. The, the two of them will double team him and probably kill him quite quickly. Man, I've really not met many people, like just one city-state, which seems a bit uh, strange. Yeah, I, I badly needed this other guy. Oh, it was 40. Okay, that's uh, interesting. Well, I'll get this second guy up here and we'll clear this out. Ooh, ouch. <laughs> might, might be able to take him over the river now. No, it did not do much damage whatsoever. Uh, can I heal through an attack on a hill on, from a weak guy? I'm going to guess I can. <laughs> this guy, No, okay, I, he, he didn't attack me. That's nice. Right, we'll just heal up while uh, I get a bit of... Uh, actually, no, we'll move him into there so he can attack at the same turn. We'll clear this out, get, get myself the same size as the river... All this work just to take one simple camp out. Show the clay, say to him that fashion. Okay, pottery. Oh, we're gonna have another uh, guy to fight in a minute. Oh, I don't heal yet, do I? Oh, I shouldn't have done that. That's uh, that's gonna come back and well, I can't say haunt me, but more just hurt me. Um. Oh, fish. Yes. Oh, that's perfect. That's absolutely perfect. Okay, so I probably could have got away with that warrior in that case. Sorry, that um, worker, but still, it's nearly finished now. We'll finish the worker, uh, build a, uh, build another, um, I don't know, it's pretty expensive to pick warrior. You know, I'll get the granary uh, next. Yeah, this worker can start building this into a bit of a city for me. Okay, don't die. That's good, I guess. Um, I I just have to have this guy heal. I don't uh, I don't think there's anything else he can do. I can weaken this guy here. Uh, probably not that much though. Okay, we'll go with golden age points. I'm looking to get golden age so I can get these um, these this ivory here to. Uh, prolong my golden edge but I, I think he should survive on top of a hill surely yeah they didn't even both attack him which is nice <laughs> this is this is really hard work uh, to kill this guy um, can I get the kill here but again he doesn't heal from it so this is uh, it's just slowing me down even more although I am liking the fate I wish I was getting more uh, culture from it though uh, I'll need to get ivory uh, I need to get um a, a social policy first though okay have these guys heal and i guess i can explore a little more and then um, yeah this worker just basically start working i get the the wheat first get some food oh that's a that's a nice uh, pile of gold Wait, who am i meeting here down here um how big is this spot like okay we have a Probably, that's probably all there is down here, but let's have a look at it. Yeah, okay, wheat first, uh, then uh, we'll get those ivory, and I uh, need to get this other... Maybe uh, that is a good second city, just so I get the second ivory in time for building... Um, in, t in time for uh, getting uh, golden ages. Okay, most stable empire. Is that good? <laughs> I'd r I'd r There's a lot of other things I'd rather... Uh, yeah, let's get him over here to help. We're still at war with India, I just remembered. 
how much money have I got? I think I'll speed up Granary um, in a second. And uh, we should be starting to get some money from kills and stuff. Well, not quite, uh, because I have picked out the the Pantheon I'd like. And um, it, it will get me plenty of money when we go ahead and get it. Right, let's uh, move these in and around the city. Um, it's, it basically gets me money from kills. And if I'm going warmongering, which I was planning and now I'm, I feel I'm even more planning it. Oh, I'd, I'd love this guy to have healing right now. Uh, let's just have him heal up. Oh, how much damage can these do? Oh, a good bit. Uh, yeah, screw it. Let's, uh, let's just attack. <laughs> I could have had him as an extra, as an extra flank, I think. I might have actually got that kill. Now, I reckon I could probably kill this guy. Um, yeah, I can get him in one go. But he'd be... Yeah, I still don't heal until I get this culture. Um, so he'd be dead after it. Um, he'd be... Yeah, this guy would kill him. Hmm. Can I go... Yeah, I guess I can get a bit of a heal off that. Yeah, let's just have these guys sit back and heal. Um, and we'll... Where will I leave this guy? Uh, maybe just leave him up on this hill. No, he could be he could be attacked right there. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Let's leave him there. See if we can snipe that worker in the, the next turn. Okay, I guess I probably need like two turns healing here. But I really Even need more workers. More warriors. The same okay, so that's trapping. It should be able to get ivory next. I guess I could do with an archer or two. Um, but we'll go with Pickish Warrior and an Archer and we maybe start taking it to India a bit. You know what? These warriors can come over here and just pillage some of this land on India and um, get me a bit of free money. Okay, so... Yeah, if I attack with... I could probably attack on one go and get the kill. Even though he's attacking over a river, I'm still worried about what kind of damage that guy could do. Right, so what am I going for here? Fishing? Oh, I could do, do with the food. Yes, that, that'd be good. I don't really see anything else that benefits me here. I guess maybe if there's animals in and around me. Um, and I would like to get to a barracks. You know, I think I might have enough food now with, uh, with the worker getting this wheat for me. And uh, yeah, let's let's go with that. Uh, so I'll, I'll see if I can get um, any animals around me, then move on to animal husbandry to build a barracks, that'll build uh, better warriors, and so on. So that's the plan. <laughs> Will it work? Who knows? I, I feel very slow. I feel I've been very slow. Okay, I think this is uh, enough to get this kill, especially with that river protecting me. Uh, and money. Was I going to do anything with this money? No, maybe I, yeah, maybe I could just buy a pickish warrior. I think, yeah, I think that's worth it. Maybe an archer, in fact. I'll keep him here, see if I can entice this guy to attack me again. The river should keep me fairly safe. All right, uh, let's... You know, I think I just have to heal. Yeah, it's a bit boring, but I think it just has to be done. Um, oh, Pantheon. Right, this isn't boring at all. Let me pause it here. I'd like to read through some more of these. I have got an idea of what I'm going for. Well, right, let me do a bit more of a read and I'll get back to you on this one. As a way to support my channel, I'd like to introduce you to the web browser that I use. It's called Brave. You'll have no difficulty using it as it works very similar to Chrome or Firefox. And you can easily import bookmarks and passwords from your current browser. The big advantage to this browser is it blocks out all the usual ads you see. But if you opt in, you can choose to be sent ads as notifications. The difference being you will be rewarded for viewing of these ads. It won't be a lot. I make about four euro a month, but that's better than the nothing you will make on other browsers. If you'd like to try this out yourself, go to the download link in the description below. It will work on both desktop and mobile. Download and try for 30 days. I'll receive a reward and you'll be helping my channel a lot. Now back to the video. Okay, I'm terrible at reading through these because I always just pick something I really want and I, I go for it. So Morgana the Harbinger is the one I've, I've locked into here. I earn gold, culture, and golden age points. Golden age points was intrigues me because with ivory, I'm going to get um, bonus golden age lens. 
uh, and with gold bonus and more bonus golden age lens so i do like that i like the golden age points and culture is always nice as well i'm i'm set setting myself up as a warmonger i'm going to start taking out a lot of camps i'm hopefully going to take out the indians um um yeah so this looks good to me i did also look at bran the sleeping guardian because i feel my food is massively behind so that would give me a bonus of growth get some culture as well um yeah that was i don't know i was glancing at the others none look great no, all look great though as well because it's it's they're all specialized and let me know what you think about this one though morgana the harbinger is what i'm going for and uh yeah that should start getting me nice extra things when i start getting some of these kills i definitely buy a, another pick warrior and come up here and start uh start building up a bit of kill a bit of kill bonuses um oh it's, it's going to take a few turns unless i take on this all right let's uh yeah let's surround this guy make sure he's not going anywhere on me and i should get an easy kill next turn oh hello uh speaking of an easy kill with a a settler in tow i'd like to keep these pick warriors as healthy as possible nah it's not gonna work oh i will get the kill there and um i can damage him he, he he doesn't have enough to fight me on his own there it doesn't look like did i get much money from that not quite an, oh enough to buy an archer though uh, let's go ahead and buy the archer build a build a pick warrior um and Oh, this that might be a kill on unprotected land, especially with a Pathfinder could get a flanking bonus. Oh, Pathfinder's dead if I'm wrong. Yeah, I am wrong. I guess the Pathfinder's not technically dead in that this guy's very weak. If I was him, I guess if I was him, I'd just uh, put the settler down, and I guess he'll probably get the kill but lose his life in the process. Okay, this is interesting. This looks like he might be setting me up for just a free city here. Right. Uh, it's so close to being a free city, isn't it? But these guys are way too weak. Okay, adopt a policy. Uh, we get go with authority. Boom, that's even more bonuses for kills. Um, how are we set up to attack this guy? Uh, Archer up on this tile here. Now, I need to get I need to get out of here and uh, heal up. I think. Oh, I don't think I really want to cross the river. Oh, wait, that was the pathfinder. Um, yeah, let's leave this guy on that tile. I think he might be safe enough where he is. Uh, let's get the pathfinder back into the city to heal. It'll just be a little faster. Okay, this is a lot of camps. Um, pick warriors. With two pick warriors should be able to just clear through these. That'll get me so much bonuses. How do, how do I go about doing that though? <laughs> Too much to do. That's the problem with Civ, you know. Obviously, you can't just build everything at the same time. You can't go every path at the same time. Peace Treaty. Ooh, interesting. Yeah, I think I'll take the Peace Treaty, clear out a few camps, and then uh, come back and take out Mumbai. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't get anything from him there, like in the sense that. I didn't kill that guy. I killed one Pathfinder and took one worker. You know, I'm just going to accept that. Yeah, I, I, like I can't do anything. I can't attack him here. Um, and he might end up uh, sniping some of my units perhaps. Okay, let's get this. Uh... Yeah, he should be okay on his own there. Um, we'll have him heal a little. You know, let's come back to the city and heal. Uh, it's going to be just a little bit faster, I think. Um, yeah, this guy with a archer in line should be able to help. Uh, Milan wants me to go to war with India. Good, I'm going to be friends with you. Um, which means I'm not going to bully you. Okay, so you've good on you there. Uh, I definitely want to snipe that kill if that's possible. Right, Milan bullied by Gandhi. Ah, that's why he wants me to go to war on him. Is that something I should have been paying more attention to? That sort of mechanic where uh, if I bully a city-state, that then a, a, a save all of a sudden goes to war with me. That, that could be why. Right, what do we get here? Let's see if anything appears. Uh, I see sheep. That's uh, something, I suppose. A chariot archer. I don't think we'll be going with that. Okay, we'll have... 
I have this guy heal, I think, while uh, we build this up. Right, what are we going with next? We, we're we saying military theory. Yeah, because I, I want to build a good few pick warriors here. Oh, this is interesting. Um, he's unprotected. We'll damage him. Might be a kill. Boom. Okay, let's. What are we getting here? 18 culture, 16 fate. Uh, I think I've seen golden age points. I'm just looking at the golden age points. How quickly are they going to go up? Uh, I don't think. Uh, well, I just. I'm worried. I want to get my um, ivory, my total ivory before it does. I guess I'll have to build myself a. A uh, settler at some stage. Right, uh, let's lock in uh, what we're working on here. Um, that looks fine to me. Yeah. Uh, maybe I will build a settler next turn. Although I do need to clear out um, that camp there. Well, where is my second city going to be going? Oh, I never looked for that gold. Let's have a look. Um, yeah, I don't see any anywhere. That looks fine to me. Um, I think I build uh, my settler now. Maybe one more pick warrior first. No, let's build a settler now. These two pick warriors can clear out this camp for me. Uh, settler can uh, park himself over here because I, basically I want that ivory, and I, yeah, I don't reach it. So this ivory is integral to me. I think I need three ivories when I get my first golden age because I want those extra. Like twenty percent extra golden age lint. Um, yeah, we'll have these guys heal up and come over and help them now in a minute. Oh, uh, was I always able to see these horse? That's that's nice as well. Where do I go? Maybe I guess I want that river. Ah, extra citizen. Perfect. Um, I'll go ahead and take that. Right, gotta be a little careful here. Yeah, let's try and get this guy surrounded a bit. Yeah, I don't want to lose out to Gandhi wherever he is. So, oh, did he just? Uh... Yeah, I still don't think if there's one uh, warrior there that can do it. I I probably need to get this pathfinder. Let's bring the pathfinder over now, actually, and uh, we'll go check out what's behind all of that. Yeah. Let's have a look for hills. Uh, no hills around them I can pop on. Let me just uh, wait here until I get back up. I'd, I'd fancy taking one out. Okay, Milan are aiming. How have I only met uh, one city state? I really need to, or two. I really need to visit more of the world. Um, Right, I'm going to go out towards logistics, I think. Yeah, so that's barrage. I always forget, so I need to go in there and check. And when are we next turn, I'll be able to get the kill. Oh, there it looks like a good enough uh, starting spot, doesn't it? Or starting a uh, second city. But no, no, I forgot. Ivory is the important thing. If, if there's no ivory here, there's no go. Um, okay, that city stay will be interesting to be... I should be able to get a lot of points out of them. Right, let's move this pick. I need more. <laughs> I need more of everything. Let's move him around the side. Ah, so there was a guy uh, that would have been able to take our kills. Should, might be able to get this kill now. Um, let's see. Yeah, it says I can... You know what? There's a, like a chance that he doesn't die, in which case he steals it. Whereas I don't think he's strong enough to kill it now. So let's just wait one turn. I think we should be fine. Uh, this warrior is... Yeah, whatever the fastest route to get there, please. And we'll start this killing. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll guarantee to get this kill this time, though, I think. And I got a little more experience on my archer as well. Okay, so more... Oh, there we go. We get more culture. Do I want to go... I need a settler. I've just built one, though. You know, I think I want this. Um, I want to get the extra bonus from... Si the extra science as I kill things. And we'll go out this one later. Although, right, cities gain 20 gold and production when their borders expand, scaling with era. So I don't have many cities. This would be good, wouldn't it? Yeah, you know, I'll go this one. And I think I'll go Settler and then get Dominance. Although I do like just getting that uh, science straight away. 
Uh, let's get this guy exploring. There must be some city states just close enough, I'd say. Um, we'll get this guy exploring. Also, we can come over here and help clear these camps out, actually, on the way now that I think about it. Um, it might be... Yeah, I might just declare war on India. I get a bonus from Milan. Oh, you know what? No, let's uh, let's get this guy up here and we'll clear out this camp. Um, when I clear out the camp, then I'll maybe declare war in India. Just to double up the bonus I'm getting from this guy. Uh, just to get the influence up nice and high. Oh, gold. Oh, yeah, yeah. I want to... I still want... I, I'm not seeing a third gold. I wonder do I need three gold. Um, I, I guess it doesn't tell me because I'm not working one of them. Yeah, it won't tell me how many there are. I, I'm tempted to work one of them just to find out how many there are. Okay, let's start killing, I suppose. This guy's a handy one. I, I really hope there's nobody standing over there and it's going to steal this hey, kill my, from me. Uh, ivory. Yeah, I'll go ahead, but I want to... Impossible. Yeah, I think I'll get five. Well, I'll ask other people and get see if I can get five. And, uh, oh, hello. Uh, Pathfinder might be able to come and deal with that. That's a little annoying. Uh, you know, let's get this guy down to deal with that. Well, there's a lot of uh, warriors here. Okay, so that should be a good bit of money. Oh, how is my money, actually? Do I need any of these? Uh, monument, shrine, well. Like a well could be good. Uh, it's just one extra production, though. No, I think I'd rather uh, some pick warriors. I'll build one and buy one, perhaps. Uh, let's see. I need... Um, how close are we to the golden age? No, it's actually not going up too fast. Okay, so I could probably wait a little. Let's go ahead and get the gold in that case. Or is this... Uh, no, the sheep isn't in. Yeah, let's uh, go ahead and work the gold. We'll have to stay away from that warrior, though. And um, what's going on here? I'm controlling. Who, who have I just sent over there now is my problem. Because I've probably sent someone over the other side of the world. Okay, look at the time. Wow, it's uh, getting late. I like to keep my first video short, which I've already failed on. Um, but, you know, another turn or two. How can I say no? Uh, I want to get the kill with the, with the pick warrior. Um, I don't see there's any advantage or disadvantage to doing that, so I'll go ahead and do that. Yeah. Oh, you're going for the gold. Yeah, I'll wait to get the kill with the pick warrior just because it's getting it'll get much more fate for me. And um, this guy can probably kill him on his own. Do you know what? Let's just make him sure he's healed up so he can defend the settler when he comes in, and then we'll have more. Uh, we'll have more pick warriors in a moment. You know, one more turn just, I promise. And then I'll end this now. And it hasn't been all that successful. I have to say, it was just really slow starting. Um, but I'm feeling pretty strong now. Like, I've got a lot of things going for me. I don't think India should be all that strong. I might be able to just wipe them out nice and quick. At least that's the, the hope. Um, right, one more turn and we'll get the pick warrior. Sorry, when I say one more turn, I don't mean I'm playing one. I will stick to my promise and end it here. Uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Uh, what mistakes have I made? Um, obviously, I'm not going to be playing perfect. I don't intend to. This is just, I enjoy it. So hopefully you enjoy watching a bit of it. But yeah, I think I maybe I could have just put my foot on India's throat a bit more. Maybe I should have ignored them. At the start, maybe I could have done something better with my city to grow it faster. I'm not sure, but I'm I'm gonna pour out some pick warriors here and hopefully just take Mumbai and Delhi, and boom, there we go. I'm down to just two people to worry about. Uh, how are we looking at tech wise? Like we're already quite behind. India is actually in the lead, so it's good that we're right beside them. Anyway, hopefully you tune in in the next uh, video and see how I get on. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.